They did say to the left, right? Yes, they did. Get him. Get him. Oh, teach these zombie pigs a lesson is what I say. Good job, laddies. Yeah, all right, everybody. We are here today taking a look at a little upcoming banger by the name of Hog Lands. Now, this one, when I first saw it, Recently, mind you, it's a demo that just hit a couple of days ago. I'll have a link for you down below. But I saw it in action in the Steam page, and it instantly reminded me of Until We Die. Now, if you remember Until We Die, it's essentially kind of like an evolution on the Kingdom formula. And Hoglands essentially now takes what Until We Die added to the Kingdom formula. And thus it's staying a little bit different as well, but still within those realms, and more importantly, the art style itself, very, very charming. We're going to be dealing with all sorts of undead creatures, mystical beings. I'm not too entirely sure about the story, but I guess we'll figure it out here as we go along. But the gameplay itself looked very promising, and the art style itself as well looked very, very good. Okay, so we have started here, as you can see, take it all in with the visuals, I absolutely love it. It kind of has a little bit of that, like, uh, Don't Starve vibe to it. I guess that's probably the reason why I liked it so much. Sir, Count Porcula has ordered an inspection of the outpost. Count Porcula, I like that. It has been a long time since there has, was any news. If we want to be there before morning, we have to move forward immediately. So, my fellas, come on over here with me. We have a shield boy, we have a flamethrower in the front. We can also organize the, you know, like in Until We Die as well. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna probably say Until We Die a lot of times here. Somebody keep count how many times I mentioned that game. I suppose that's what we should do here. Take the units and go to the distant collateral. Strange fog, what is that? We have to be alert. I mean, I think we'll be fine over here with this dude, apparently a flamethrower. Oh! oh, oh. Now, we can indeed attack ourselves. But, since we got Flamethrower up front, we have a Shield Boy, we'll hang out behind. And play defensively, as we can see a thing over here. What kind of plants are these? They emit poisonous mist! Burn them! With the help of the Flamethrower, we can fight against hostile plants. Hostile plants? I mean, the only hostile plants of familiar would come from, you know, like Japanese animes and... I'm not sure those are particularly in a PG format for us to speak about, but I'm just saying. Ah. Hey, get away, flamethrower man. That tentacle was getting a little bit too frisky with us right here. Okay, it seems we have a uh, cross. Oh, we can indeed run too. That makes sense. But we probably have a stamina type of system. As to interact, uh, sure. Who wants to interact with this? Oh, okay, so Shovel Boy could apparently take, uh... This thing apart from us. Yeah, go ahead. Both of you do it. Thank you. Let this continue here. Finally, help has arrived. Poisonous plants blocked the exit from the gorge, and monsters attacked us throughout the night. The barricades in the tower were destroyed. This is everyone who remained alive. We must prepare for the night, and in the morning try to reach the nearby outpost. There's still materials left in the chest, collect them, and restore the defense. So let's have them continue gathering resources, and let's see what the first group that we left behind is up to. Oh, you guys are done. Good. And it seems we could probably now build our first little barricade. Let's go. Now, unfortunately, I don't think we have any builders. Can Shovel Boys build, I wonder? Let's, let's find out. What do we have over here? A little tower? I mean, we do have archers, so I guess that would be fine. One, two. And what the hell is this? Like a tar pit? Oh, and we're gonna slow them down over here. So now you guys build away. Are there more resources to gather off to the right, I wonder? Oh. Music got spooky. No, no. This is basically where it ends. You can order your squad of units to guard the barricade by pressing S near it. Yes. Hey, um, buddy. It might not be time for this right now. Oh, 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 oh boy! That's uh, kind of a big dude for the first night, isn't it? <laughs> oh, oh, that's a big bug. Oh, that's a big bug. I'm trying to see what the enemy is. Who's the one with the axe? I see the zombie pigs. That's okay. Oh, it's like a big zombie. Okay. Hey, hey, come on. <laughs> I'm trying to run. Get, get out of here. <laughs> well. 
Okay, well, our introduction's out of the way now. We are left to our own devices. Where did I end up? What kind of place is this? What happened to the guys that I had with me? Not everybody died. Greetings, this is a settlement of free pigs. Why, who are you and why did you come to us? Our outpost was destroyed by some creatures I have never seen before. I've come to warn you of danger. So the robots are true. You have to help us prepare for the attack. Okay. That I will. On the western and eastern side, there are places to organize defense and build barricades there. Yes. Thanks for tutorials. Tell me about that, but appreciate it. Uh, let's see. No interaction with you, but uh, whoever is available for recruitment, please come on by. Each day the merchant arrives at your location. Yes, they've already spoken to me about this. And he'll bring people that we can hire. Yes. Great. This guy requires how many nuts? Six nuts. We got no nuts. <laughs> Hi -yo. I mean, I do. But let me tell you now, right now. Um, can you guys collect those? Yes. Here's what I'll do. One of you collect this, because I see a little stack right here. And you are going to work on this one. And I'm solo here for now. I guess I go swing. You know what I love about this? They gave your character a flail. And I'm a big, big sucker for the flails, baby. Okay. So is this enough to hire this goon? Hi, welcome to freedom, pal. Now, meanwhile, let's have uh, defenses, is what we were told, right? We apparently have none. We might need some. So, my friend, you get to building here to the right. Let's see what we have happening over here. All right, come on, let's go through that already, huh? Cool. Let's have us maybe work on the left one, too. At least have some barricades up for the first night. I guess this will be it. Oh, look at my dude. He's over here sweating it away. And here it is. How much do we need for this? Ooh, a lot of nuts. Do we have enough nuts for this one? Oh, we're one. <laughs> we're one nut. <laughs> Short. I'm never going to get tired of just basically making that joke over and over at this point. This game has given me, like, you know, basically full, full freedom. To make nut euphemisms as much as I want. Okay, this should be good now for this. These are mushrooms, so... We do have zero mushrooms. I wonder if those will probably be for, like... Oh, that's why I gotta also get this built, huh? Oh, you're done here already. Perfect. I wonder if, like, mushrooms would be for, like, you know, research or something. Until we die. There, I said it again. Also, I had a similar thing where I guess... I forgot what the resource was, but one was explicitly just for research, research purposes. Are you done there? Come on, buddy. Great. We have a little timer up there. Seems a little bit generous, that timer. I wonder if it's only because like, it's letting me... It's allowing me to finish up these things first. But it's a very... Go there. Yeah. It's a very courteous timer when it comes to giving me some time to do some things here before night shows up. All right, we're up to 14 nuts right now. That's great. Oh, we got our first mushroom, too. Uh, I guess we could build... Oh, this will be to get some archers, judging by the little poster next to it, huh? Uh, we cannot upgrade our towers anymore. I guess for that, what we need to do is basically upgrade the front, huh? Yeah. Do we have enough nutties for that? I would say we do. It's a big investment, but if we get level 2, I think that'd be fine. We don't have too many units right now is the only problem, so... Doing this is gonna, you know, hamper us quite a bit. Because I think we only have, like, two guys now? He needs inspiration, so to speak. Uh, apparently, he's a big shroom head. He's got to trip some balls in order to get some work done. All right, there you go, buddy. Pop a cap. Enjoy your trip. Did you see how he likes mushrooms? Nevertheless, there is one problem. They're addictive. <laughs> I told you. He's going to be popping caps the entire time. He would be a plague doctor for that reason. So every single time, it'll increase how many mushrooms you need, obviously. So nothing surprising there. Uh, let's have you help out with this. Okay, and they are done. So I imagine this will let us fortify our walls even further. Uh, let's see. Let's have one of you guys work on this big patch, and then I guess you over here. Great! Come to Winter where you can... You can. I have something important to tell you. Can I grab these things now? Oh, I can. Oh, now they're giving me freedom. Yeah, I guess they wanted me to do that before they... ...sent me off. Hello, my friend. Uh, meanwhile, here's what we do. We do work in this pile right here. Heh <laughs> Multitask at all times. Greetings! It seems that the vampire has settled in the old crypt at the cemetery of the west of us. Is, is it Count Porcula? If it's true, you have to get rid of that vampire before it's too late. Kill the crypt and inhabitants off to the left. So I wonder this will be like kind of like our portals or those pods in until we die. So we either the portals in kingdom or the pods in until we die. And that's basically where these enemies will be spawning from at nighttime. So. 
Let's see. That dude is still researching. Is there anything else that we can acquire here? We're at 21. I guess we could try to build that to get an archer. Should we do that now? This guy being a bad idea. Let's probably... Yeah, let's put the nuts down for that at least. We technically have no long-range capability, so that'll help us out. The only problem is that obviously we have to also put in a worker in there, and we're already kind of down to two workers, so we will build it. And there's another one here. I guess this will be probably from melee. So here's the problem. We don't know if we're going to attack from left or the right, so nighttime's almost here. We might want to assign homeboy to the right. <laughs> Look at my dude completely flush the cheeks, too. Alright, I don't think he's going to get this done, because I need to rush off to the left to keep an eye on the homeboy over there, make sure he barricaded, or at least got the upgrade. So, you, my friend, need to... Oh, lights came on. That's got to be our sign that things are about to get crazy, so we even bring the torch out and everything. Pump those legs. Oh, I'm tired. How's it going, buddy? Hey, nice little barricades here. Okay. I guess we chillax here a little bit. As a matter of fact, come on over here with me. I'm gonna, you know, play it a little bit of risque, as they say. Monsters spotted another. Okay, no, no, never mind. Never <laughs> not, not risque anymore. Not risque anymore. Okay. It's just me and you, buddy. What do we got here? We got it. Zombie pigs. Whack them with the flail. Oh, let's go. Actually, we're fixing that? Yeah, yeah, that's great. You know what? It's the first night. I can't imagine them sending more. I have a feeling that was probably just those three zombies, so that's perfect. Oh, and you're done. Merchant will supply one more slave for three days. Every tent will have two additional supplies. Opening chests will give three additional acorns for the next three openings. Bonfires gives health buff to nearby units. Ooh, that sounds very useful. But we need... We're, we're low... We're low... Supply hand when it comes to bodies. So I think I'm gonna go with this one here for now. Perfect. Daytime is here, so we are now safe. Let's see about you working on finishing this up. That'd be great. Oh, and I got um this for you. Perfect. Aha, here we go. Let's pop the chest open. So we get one dude no matter what per day, right? And then these are the additional ones we could hire. And we got the nuts for these boys right here. And this is basically two because we got that buff for two. Can two of you work on that? Yes, you can. Now, what else can we work on? What else do we need to work on? There's a lot of things to work on. But for now, let's come out here and boom, boom. I'm curious about seeing this crypt, you know? And there's another barricade up here. Come with me, my friend. Uh, work on this one, then we'll see about building this barricade over here. I do want to kind of get us at least with two barricades. I know here we have the buffed up one. The one on the right isn't buffed up, so we should consider at the very least maybe moving one more barricade downwards. And buffing that one up, and then we'll leave the weaker one up front. Okay, so we're not gonna increase this one. Oh, I'm tired. Got still some daytime, but it's starting to run a little bit low. Where was the other? Here it is. All right, pal. I need you to work on this, and stay there because we're gonna upgrade it afterwards. We should have enough nuts for that. I'm hoping these two dudes have completed my arch. Oh, they have. Perfect. Um, It's going to put us a little bit low-handed, but you know what? Now, we have ourselves an actual fighter. Now, this dude, the only problem is I don't think he collects anything, right? So, or builds. So that's going to hurt a, li a bit. But, we can now also set up a little archer tower behind and have him just snipe away. Have better defenses that way. Oh, hey, 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 yeah, sorry. I forgot that uh, you need to actually build. Are you sure you can't collect me, thing, dog? Like, a, a single thing? You can't? No, okay. I figured as much, but I just wanted to double make sure. Hopefully, homeboy here solo could get that upgrade up. He should, I hope. But now, we are very, very spread thin when it comes to workers. We also need more mushrooms for the next research. I am tired. Nighttime's almost here. There is a lot of worries here at the moment. There's two dudes to the left, right? Or is it just one? Two, yeah. Well, they did fairly good. 
Um, man, I need to rush quickly to the right right now. All right, let's go, boys. I need to put you on these walls, like, right, right now. One, Archer, huh? Two, okay, yeah. You guys stay there. Hopefully we don't get attacked from the right. Hopefully it's from the left. I feel more confident with the Archer and an extra worker here. Hopefully we can make it over here to the right as well. Come on, come on. Pop those legs. Monster spot on the left side. Perfect. And you got the upgrade over here. Beautiful. So, they're being attacked over there. You can see up top. But I'm hoping Archer and Homeboy alone is... I mean, that that, that barricade seems to be... Oh, God. I'm, why doesn't it stop blinking? Please stop blinking. Please don't lose the barricade. Oh, Mama, it stopped. Oh, it stopped. Oh, I was worried. I thought it was like, you know, it's late night, too. You tell me you're going to lose the, the barricade with an upgraded unit already for combat purposes. We're going to lose it. Hey, good job, boys. Oh, no. One of you can indeed fix that. So right hand side, we probably shouldn't be attacked now, which means now at nighttime we have full. Full proxy to do as we wish. There's another barricade expansion right there. But, I'm curious about some goods. Mainly because we now, I think, what did we do? We did, nice. We did three mushrooms in the last research, right? So the next one's going to probably at least be five or six. So you know what? This guarantees we could actually get the next research up and running. And I also am very curious about seeing this crypt. Because I feel like we're almost running out of time with this video. I'm not even sure when I started. But this is the type of game where I basically just lose track of time because it's basically so engrossing. You're basically trying to figure out, you know, okay, what's the right, you know, efficient way to start doing all this stuff here. So I feel like I've been recording quite a bit. Mushrooms over here, which is fine. We just don't have anybody to pick them. There it is. Kill the crypt inhabitants. It seems we're going to need proper units, more than likely either the flamethrower maybe to burn through, maybe the shovel boys to break through that little barricade. So we know we have the shovel thing to the left, at least our left side of our base, so we could probably work on that here. You work on this. We still have one freed up boy. Our research should be ready too, right? He's going to be in those nuts for a bit. <laughs> I know how they came off, but he's going to be in that net field for a bit. It's quite a big, and it's only one. It's only one hog, you know? I'm not crazy about how far it is from here to the next barricade, though. So we might want to extend over here. Maybe. Because since we have to travel really, really far. Okay, so here, this would be for... Hopefully, shield, boys. Work at it. You join me. Get our resources for the day. One, two. And do we have enough to hire these two fellas? Yes, we do. Very good. Under me. Okay. Right. And then you. Hero gains leadership aura, enhancing abilities of picks around them. Archers will now shoot burning arrows, dealing increased damage to enemies. So maybe right now, the problem is how often am I around a place when we're fighting? Not too often, but whenever we fight the crypt, I imagine we'll need it, right? So yeah, let's pick that one up. And now you need five, and we have eight, so that is beautiful. And we have another archer available here. Let's do it. Let's do it. I want to have one archer posted up at each station, at least for now. I'm not sure what that one is right there, a little barrel. Do we have a freed up pig here? No, we don't. Huh? I figured we didn't. So here's what I'm gonna do. It's nighttime, or at least close to it. You guys are in defense duty for that one. I'm gonna see if I can rush my ass over here. I'm hoping those guys are done, you know, picking those nuts over there from that chest. Cause we, oh man, we left homeboy. I just realized we left homeboy on the left, all oh, the way off the field, didn't we? Oh man, that's gonna be tough. Um, man, 
Oh, man. Dude, there's a... Should probably... I really should get that barricade, I think. Because otherwise, from our current barricade all the way here to the left, it's very, very far. Nope. Oh, he's coming back. So at least, basically, he is going to run back once nighttime shows up. This is a very stupid idea on my part, what I'm doing. I'm getting greedy, though, because I'm remembering those nuts that he was working on. Oh, my God. Left side. Okay. Hey, but you know what? Don't these guys have... Oh, on the right side, too. Oh, luckily, we left boys over there. Now he's going to get back to... Oh, I can't run anymore. I mean, don't I have the aura effect? <laughs> you guys are powered up by my aura, right? Oh, boy. Can we make it? Can we make it? Oh! You need extra barricade, Falcon? I know I do. I know I do. Oh, we made it. Everybody there. It seems that the right attack is been depleted. So that's good. They did say to the left, right? Yes, they did. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, teach these zombie pigs a lesson is what I say. Good job, laddies. And they should be 100% fine. We also have nuts for the last hire. I think the last, uh, the next batch of slaves will be the last one that we get two for. At least the bonus for. I want to see what the hell this is, so I'm going to go ahead and invest in it. It's four. Yeah, one of you guys or two of you guys built this. I'm, I'm curious what the hell that is. There's also another station over here, too. This one seems to be working. I wonder if this is where you get the flamethrower. And this is where we get the tower. Wait, we're being attacked on the left-hand side? But, but it's daytime. Technically. Kind of. Oh no, don't lose the barricade. We good? It stopped. Oh my god, how long was that being attacked? I didn't even realize it. Yo, I was I was gonna get super mad because I was like, wait, wait a minute, you you can't send like a super delayed attack after we take care of the initial dudes. Who are you to troll me this way? Now you made me lose, you know, break my train of thought, whatever the hell is planning on the right hand side. I right, guys work on this. Either way, I'm pretty sure way over time in this one. Now guys, I'm gonna wrap it up here. I hope you have enjoyed this event until we die. Essentially, yo, kingdom. And until we die in a nutshell, except are we still being attacked on the left hand side? <laughs> Are you kidding me? It's daytime! What the hell is this? What the hell is this? It requires uh, quite a few nuts to interact with, too. Well, I'm a learning boy. I don't know what that is. Either way, as I was saying, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Information down below, because you want to check it out for yourself. It is a free demo currently. Definitely very promising. I'll catch you guys next time.